Eurobike 2018. I'm here with Claudio from Villier. He's going to tell us a bit more about a UCI Legal Disc TT bike. Hi everybody, welcome back to Villier. Yes, uh, this is one of the first TT bike disc UCI Legal. We get a former frame that was with the standard brakes. It was the time to make something advanced. Wheels, uh, now all the riders use carbon wheels. You know, the carbon wheel with standard brakes, not always the best solution, especially if a wet condition. So we think of a completely new design. Also because the disc brakes, somebody say that's not less aerodynamic, that is a little bit true, but also make us the freedom to make the design of the fork as we want. If we take a look, uh, the fork is very wide. So there is less turbulence compared to the standard forks that must be close to the wheel. So we have the trouble, let's say, of the disc brakes, but the plus of the aerodynamics. So at the end, there is a win, is a win solution, in fact. The frame compared to the previous frame is lighter, so that's common. But also we work in the integration. You can see there is no any single cable exposed. And you said there's a cool feature on the bars as well. Yes, uh, we want to make life easy. So our uh, bar is foldable, in fact. Uh, the stem remains, you can slide it to side. So when you travel to Kona, you can use a small bag and go easy. Mr. Dreitz will, go, will fly to Kona this uh, November. Uh, it was second uh, last week in Roth. So good luck to Andy and no trouble with the travel, for sure. So yeah, pretty good for packing in your bike bag and stuff like that. And now we're on to a disc brake road bike. Yeah, there's the new 110 Pro. It is the same shape of last year 110 Air, but we improved the torsional stiffness. So we want that a professional rider will profit of that. In this special case, you see a special color. These are what they call copper. Copper is our historical color. We win Giro d'Italia in the 48th with a steel frame with this color. So now we want to show we are a company advanced technologically because the frame is an aero, it takes some design from the turbine. We have an integrated bar with all the cables again running full inside, but still keeping the heritage of a special color that not everybody can get it. Gravel riding is obviously very popular in cycling right now and you guys have the Yenna. Yes, uh, we introduced a couple of years ago our range alloy, then we start again with the steel. Now is the moment for a carbon gravel. It's light, ready to compete, but also thanks to the millions of islets to go for one week in the nature with bags. It's a do-everything bike. And what wheel size and tyre size can it take? You see, on that bike you can see there is a 700C with a 42mm, it goes also to 44 but uh, you can put a 60-50B uh, rim and then a, a kind of 50, 48, 50 uh, tire MTB. Again, it's a multi-purpose bike. 